Ferrara's internal crisis has reportedly gone from bad to worse after just one race of the new Formula One season. Ferrara's early season crisis has reportedly taken another worrying twist behind the scenes, with more of their staff members seeking a way out of the team after becoming disillusioned with the leadership from the very top. The historic Italian outfit endured a disappointing time of things at the season opening Bahrain Grand Prix, with Carlos Sainz failing to get on the podium and Charles Leclerc being forced into an early retirement due to an engine failure. New team principal Frederick Vasseur has already been forced to deal with the exit of a key member of staff this year, with aerodynamics chief David Sanchez having tendered his resignation ahead of an expected move to McLaren later in the season. It seems as though at least one further departure could soon be on the horizon at Ferrari in the form of race director Laurent Mekis, who has reportedly grown frustrated with the management approach of CEO Benedetto Vigna. That's according to Formula 1A.1, who are reporting that Mekis is desperate to quit Ferrari amid internal discontent towards Vigna's cumbersome leadership style. He is already said to have received a handful of offers from elsewhere on the grid, while it is claimed that he has also been approached by the FIA as he mulls over a return to the governing body after leaving his previous role with them back in 2018. Mickey's would supposedly prefer to report directly to Vasseur rather than Vigna, who has taken on a more prominent role within the team following Mattia Bonato's exit at the end of last season. Vasseur, meanwhile, would prefer to keep Mekis in order to avoid further complications that could arise from any potential resignation due to his contract status. The possibility of additional departures from Ferrari over the coming weeks cannot be entirely ruled out, with Inaki Rueda also said to be considering his future within the team after being demoted from his former role as head of strategy earlier this year. It remains to be seen whether Ferrari will be able to bounce back over the coming weeks in spite of their ongoing internal crisis, which is already threatening to derail their efforts to clinch the end-of-season honors after just one race. The uncertainty over the futures of several team members is reportedly contributing to an increasingly tense mood behind the scenes at Marinello, while their reliability issues at the Bahrain Grand Prix will have done little to ease fears of another lackluster campaign given the hugely impressive start made by Red Bull. However, it was recently claimed by Vasseur that Ferrari's current issues both on and off the track are merely teething problems and will sort themselves out as the season progresses. I never saw a car able to match the pace of another one in quali and not be able to win the race said Vasseur as he reflected on Ferrara's disappointing weekend in Bahrain. It's a matter of setup and some choices on the car. It's not a matter of concept at all. It's never good to start with a DNF and I would have preferred to finish like Red Bull, for sure, but now I want to stay consistent in my position. I told the team before, the test, in Bahrain two weeks ago that the championship won't be over in Bahrain it doesn't matter the result in any case. It was true for the winter test, and it's true for, the first race. The most important, thing, now is to be able to have a clear picture of the situation, where we are failing, do a proper analysis on this and to come back stronger as soon as possible. 